Hey guys, how are you today? Happy Friday. I'd love to say it's a bright, beautiful, sunny day, but no, it's coming down in buckets right now. Uh, Hank's under our feet because he doesn't like the thunder. You all know how he is with storms. Um, Patty's going to run real soon, but I wanted her to talk a little bit about her crochet sweater. This is one of her favorites. Come on up, Patty. Hi. Uh, this is called Peach Sorbet. It is by Christina Smiley. I don't know if you all can see that. I don't do this very well. There we Perfect. Go. Um, but it is a real simple knit uh, crochet. Um, the back is the same as the front. And I own two so far and would like to start another one. But it's a real quick, easy crochet. It's good for a beginner also. So and what give was it a the try. Name of the pattern it again? is called Peach Sorbet Tea Top. And um, it's in fingering weight yarn? It is in fingering weight, yes. Yep. Yeah. So take some um, anywhere from 800 to 1600, depending on the size. So, so. two skeins up to four skeins. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we love our crocheters because you use so much yarn. Yeah, oh. uh, Emma Hellahanks would be really good for it. That would be, that would be great. Because two of those would be anything up to a large. That would be perfect. So that would work really well. So Great. It's great. Thank you, and You're have welcome. a great weekend. Thanks. I'll I hope you, you do too. Tuesday. Yeah, see you Tuesday. Thanks again. <laughs> hey guys, we have so much to talk about today. What a busy day. Wow. Uh, so much has come out today. This week has just been fun. I'm dyeing yarn like crazy. We've got new needles in. It's. We hope we can get to everything, and I won't keep you too long because I know dinner's probably cooking. Uh, first thing we're going to talk about here, pattern mom's going wild over, is Love Galore. And this one is by Monster Knits, Kelly Monster. Oh, Love Grows Here, sorry. Love Grows Here. Uh, let's get you a better picture of that. There we go. Gorgeous. And it's really funny that this came out because I've been dyeing these wonderfully gorgeous summery colors. And then this pattern comes out. So maybe we were reading each other's minds because look what we got hibiscus. Now this is under socket to you, color hibiscus. Right now I have four of them, but I'll be dying more and I'm very happy to die to order. I have a lot of this yarn and I'm thrilled to get it going for you. Uh, this one here is stands on one foot. And if Hank wasn't behind me blocking my chair from getting up, I would demonstrate. Hey guys, Debbie, Barbara, Donna, how you doing? Happy rainy day to you too. So all socket to you. It's 400 yards, 100% superwash and hibiscus. So how much fun can we have with these? Well, now is when we play with our mini skeins. We have many, many skeins to talk about. Of course, there's Emma's. And Emma's mini skeins are all under the web, on the website, practically perfect small. And it takes eight of them. Hey, Heather, how are you? So we want to find the happiest eight colors we can possibly gather. And it's nice if they're kind of flower colors. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, eight. How's that? And those go with both collections, depending on what you want to do. So lots and lots and lots of fun stuff here. Great combinations. Sheep Graffiti has Twisty U, and you can combine them. They are actually the same base yarn. Um, you can go in and see what I've got order accordingly. If you don't see the color listed, click on the miscellaneous colors. You'll see a big basket of them or all thrown out on the table. Hey, Sherry. Uh, you can then write in in the notes which colors you want and I'll hold them for you. I will be dying more of them because I can't stop. They're just so darn cute. So more mini skeins and these are the Sheep Graffiti Twisty U. 
Emma Practically Perfect Smalls. Really fun stuff, guys. And that is all for Love Grows Here by Callie Monster. Big shout out to Callie. By the way, one of the best pattern designers, uh, very well written, really concise, um, wonderful tutorials. There's a little daisy stitch in here. Mom says it's absolutely amazing. Let's see what Heather's saying here. Ah, Heather's moving, so she's going to contact us for this wonderful yarn when she gets a chance. So that is one of our fun things today. Now for the next one. I saw this. I really want to cast on. Oh my gosh. You know how bad I am with that, guys. I have cast on itis, and this one did it for me. Cinnabar by Andrea Mowry. Isn't that amazing? Dreamy, awesome, fabulous, brioche. I love brioche. We might have to do a little Zoom class on that, guys. We're thinking about it. Talk to me. Tell me if you want it. Hey, Lori, how are you? So let's talk about Cinnabar and all the wonderful combinations. Excuse me, Hank. Let me pull my yarn around here because this is going to be really fun. Just lower that a little bit. There we go. Okay. So, the pattern calls for spin cycle. We have dyed in the wool. It's on the website. We have wilder. It's on the website. I can put together kits if you want to, or you can choose your own. We have a lot. So, run, 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 run. It's awesome. Hey, Meta, how are you? Uh, this is the light wilder light gray and this is the dark gray so now the fun part we've got oh you need four of these and three dyed in the wool tangled up in blue and that goes with either one really really nicely i love this one with the light this is probably one of my favorites this is nostalgia and this is with the light gray. Nostalgia and the light gray. Uh, dark gray, I like the saddest place. Now mom put up some Facebook posts earlier, um, Shades of Earth. Rusted rainbow, light or dark. And which one did I not get here? Runation. Dark and light. I love Runation. It's purple. It's just got the best colors in it. It's fun. We have a huge, huge assortment of spin cycle dyed in the wool. Hey, Joanne. Um, I can take you all over there in a little bit and we'll look at the whole wall. Uh, I'll show you what we have tons of combinations this shawl is just so awesome i can't wait to start it i might be casting on i think that's talking to me you know how i feel about these colors right um really awesome oh other thing quince this is quince finch it calls for a dk or a sport yarn um joined up with the spin cycle dyed in the wool, which is a sport weight yarn. I love Quince Finch. Finch is a heavier fingering. It can pull off sport weight. We also have Chickadee, which is a more of a DK weight. So that's up to you. That's um, personal choice. So this is going to be really, really awesome. Patty's headed out. Good night, Good night. Patty. See Thank you. you. Try to stay dry. So with Quince and company, uh, again, all of these are U.S. sourced wool. That's another thing I want to point out. 
USA from sheep to shelf. You can't beat it, guys. Uh, we've got incredible combinations of quince, and maybe we'll show some of those later on in the weekend or next week, because I think we're going to be doing this for a while, guys. I feel the need. I feel the need for brioche. I do. Um, anywho, quince finch, and look how that pops. Is that awesome? Yeah. So I'll take you over and show you a whole bunch of combinations and all the yarn we have for the dyed in the wool in a little bit. Uh, I did mention needles. Check them out. Addy Flexi Flips. So these were mentioned this morning. I put them up on Facebook. Swing around here a little bit. And I said, uh, my friend Martha said, why don't you do a video on how they work? Cool. Check them out. Why would you use these? No, they are not some odd torture device. These are, instead of double points, and they're fabulous, instead of magic loop. So here's my sock. Y'all don't see me knit socks very often, but I do. They stay in my purse, they're my take along. You will catch me sitting in front of Trader Joe on the line knitting my socks at the supermarket in line, knitting my socks. So for all of you who have seen Magic Loop, you take your needle that has the working yarn attached, you push this one in, and you pull this one with the working yarn out, and then you start to knit. Easy schmeasy. Now we're gonna move them to the flexi flips. And this is my first time. Ooh, that's nice. Very nice needle, guys. You know how I love the rocket squares. And these are the Addy Rocket Squares flexi flips. They're new. I got in size zero, one, and two. I will be ordering the other sizes with my next order. You can certainly tell me what sizes you're interested in and I'll make sure those get in. I wanted to make sure you all like them before I went nuts on the sizes. Um, so far, this needle is really pleasant. Really, really nice. And you're gonna use these like you would double points. So I'm gonna put half my yarn here. Almost there, guys. Patience, patience. Oops, dropped a stitch. That you don't need to see. And for those who want to see how you pick up that stitch, you grab the ladder and flip it over. There, little fix your mistakes class. Five more stitches here. Good thing I have small feet, you're all saying, right? There we go. Oh, that's nice. Look how that bends around. So, now we're going to get the other one on there. And just for those who might be asking, this is the fish lip kiss heel, toe up. This is the top of my foot, so I know where to put my heel. And this yarn is Haverlin Sock Members Only Color. And we do have just one or two of those left. You hear that thunder behind me? Oh, it's a good day to stay in and knit. We may be staying late tonight. So what I've done here is I've just pulled my first two stitches tight. And then that lets me zip along. 
Laura's watching. Pete's watching. How are you guys? Again, I don't see everybody. Sometimes it goes really fast and Facebook doesn't always show me who's on and who's watching. So big shout out to all of you. Thank you. I really appreciate it. And of course, all the support has just been amazing. And we are open tomorrow from 11 to 5. Rebecca will be here with me. Wear your mask. Come on in. We do have some tropical weather heading up our way. I'll let you know if we end up closing that day. Right now they're thinking it'll come through Tuesday. I personally think it's going to hook a right and keep off the coast, in which case we will be open. If anything crazy happens, we'll let you know if we close up. And it's really, you know, because of Hank, because he doesn't like storms. I'd be here if I had to take a canoe. Okay, so we've got them. Check that out. So Martha, I don't know if you're watching yet or you'll see this later, but that's what they look like. So now we take our third needle. Oh, these are so smooth. Much smoother than Magic Loop. So now we're gonna hold them real close and we just knit onto the third needle. I pull the second and third stitch snug, that prevents ladders, and away we go. Oh guys, these are nice. These are really nice. Flexi flips, rocket squares. Now we do have the original Addy Turbo um, flexi flips. We have mostly the larger sizes left. I needed to order the sock sizes for a few folks. And sure enough, these are a dream. Let's see, I got a comment here. Ah, Heather, knitting socks, yay. Lots of socks, socks are fun. And I think we went over all of our striped yarn a few weeks ago. Oh my gosh, we're having fun. So we're almost at the end. trying to show you all this without dropping stitches so we don't have to do another fix your mistakes class. There we go. Oh, that's smooth. So smooth. Okay, well, one set may not make it on the shelf. Note to staff, pull one set of zeros out of inventory. Gosh, that's gorgeous. Check it out. Nice and smooth. Beautiful. Oh, dog hair. How did that get in there? Hank. <laughs> awesome. They come in these cool tubes. Easy storage. Although, I do believe I'm going to keep these. And I'll just put it through my sock. There we go. Lexi flips. Awesome. Thank you, everybody. So we talked about the flexi flips. Patty talked about her crochet sweater. We've got the wonderful, awesome Kelly Monster shawl. Let's go back and take a look at that one. Love grows here with these great, wonderful colors, like standing on one foot. And we've got the Spin Cycle Andrea Mowry Cinnabar. Let's go look at the Spin Cycle real quick and then I'll let y'all get back to dinner. Oh, and you see Hank didn't go far.
Here we go, guys. I'm going to see if I can flip this back. There we go. Okay. So, you know, I pulled a bunch of these to do the demo. That's Rusted Rainbow. I have lots of nostalgia. Um, heart sigh. I'd probably put that with a nice bright color or dark black. Um, burning Sensation. Pussy Willow. I didn't show this one because I was showing the Wilder. And I didn't want the um, grays to be too close to each other. Yay! Heather got a set of needles. Woohoo! This is the Castle. Narcissus. I love their names. Summer Love. Summer Love's going to be fun. We're going to play with Summer Love. Deep Bump. And then this is Cataclysm, but look at the difference in the skeins. Kimono. Love kimono. Lots of fun stuff. Can't pronounce that one. There you go, guys. This is one of my personal favorite. Robin's Egg. We talked about Tangled Up in Blue. Overpass. Overpass is one of my favorites. We're going to play with that. Saddest Place we talked about. Shades of Earth. Look at all the different shades of Earth. I have to show this to you folks. Those are the same color. Shades of Earth. So if you order Shades of Earth, please specify either the purple or the teal when you order. One of my favorites, Truth Bomb. That would be so gorgeous. I might have to play with that one. But with Truth Bomb, I'd mix it with a quince because the wilder gray. Well, maybe. Yeah, that's got a lot of potential. That's got a lot of potential. Runation. So let's see what we got here. Summer Love, it does go with the lighter one. And here's the darker one. Oh yeah, that'll work. That's good too. This one is Overpass. So, um, let's see how we get back here. There we go. So now, as you can see, guys, we got lots of fun spin cycle. We've been having a great time here playing. I appreciate all the support, all the love. Let you say goodnight to Hank. There you go. And all the pretty yarn we've been playing with. Check it out. There's the workstation. So, if you need anything because of the weather, I'm not going anywhere. I'm going to be here for a little while. Give me a call. Talk to me online. And I'll be here tomorrow with Rebecca from 11 to 5. So, have a great day. Good night, everybody. Stay safe.